Hi everyone of you guitar nerds and welcome back to my channel. I'm very glad that this channel is really starting to grow uh, slowly but steadily. Uh, thanks to everyone of you who has clicked subscribe on the channel to be updated on more content about guitars, demos and reviews of viewers. Today we're gonna be looking at uh, some of the top 10 best plugins you can find for free on the internet. And when I say for free, I mean totally for free, not a uh, free trial of 14 days or one month of the plugins that you have to pay for, uh, but totally free plugins, which means they will stay free forever to you. Before starting and moving on with reviewing these 10 uh, fantastic plugins, I am to say that uh, there is no particular order in which I placed those plugins. Uh, those are 10, but it doesn't mean that number 1 is better than number 10. And also let me add that it's just a subjective point of view. It's a personal pick based on my experience and on my uh, music taste. For the sake of the fairness of this comparison, I'm gonna be using only two guitars, my trustworthy port KX5 equipped with a pair of Seymour Duncan pickups and my newly purchased Holly Benton 7-string fun fret guitar. And I am also gonna go for the different head simulation using the same exact cabinet impulse response, which in this case is a Marshall. Uh, 1964 by 12 equipped with the green bag speakers. The first six plugins I'm gonna go through are all taken and downloaded from this incredible website I found out a couple of years ago, which is called Plugins for Free. Here you can find plenty of uh, VAST instrument plugins uh, as well as dedicated effects also, like uh, EQing, compressor, mastering or time-based emulation effects. Here we have the first of the plugins I downloaded from the plugins for free site uh, and to me it sounds really great. It's called Preamble Slick Head and it's pretty much based on a 100 watt plexi style head. You have here your basic clean sound <laughs> Also, if you turn up the gain, you will start to hear a crank. You're also very responsive to your touch. But here comes the trick, you have built in a treble master, which is kind of a treble booster uh, pedal. If you engage it, you will uh, um, increase your overall gain, saturation, as well as volume, with the possibility you have also to cut the frequencies. With this one engaged, you will definitely have an instant EVH sound. <laughs> Plugin is called Jesse M X100 and is currently inspired by Marshall JCM H100, one of the most known and well respected amplifiers from the 80s. As you can see, as the original amp, it has a very straightforward front panel with input gain volume, bass, middle, and treble. And as the original one, I don't know if you ever tried an original 80s. GCM 800, it has not tons of gain as you might expect. Actually, cranking the gain and the input all the way up, this is the maximum of distortion you can get of that. To 
me it sounds very very great because it definitely needs uh, that GCM 800 feeling which everybody knows about. The Motor Deluxe uh, is, uh, I think, the only very, very clean amplifier we're going to review in today, and it is based uh, upon different, uh, especially combos models from the 50s and the 60s, like the Deluxe Twin Reverb, like the Fender Tweed, and so on and so forth. Uh, it is very very complete plugins uh, to me because it also has a pedal board integrated uh, with different kind of effects like uh, reverb delay, vibrato chorus tremolo and also a compressor and also each preset, for example let's take the US C12 as a clean and a drive section, uh, each of them can be boosted or mid boosted with a graphic EQ and reverb. <laughs> of course crank it a little bit and add also a little bit of reverb This is a very very good plugin, uh, especially for clean or crunchy kind of bluesy sounds. Next one is one of my favorite. Uh, this is Le Pou, uh, which is actually not just one plugin, but a bunch of plugins which aim to recreate some iconic amplifiers like a Plexi, GCM 800, Angle, uh, Mesa Boogie Dual Rectifier, Bugner, Ecstasy, and so on and so forth. And so forth. Here I took uh, my three favorites, which are the simulation of the Mesa Boogie Dual Rectifier, which is called Lecto. <laughs> sounds close to a Mesa Boogie Dual Rectifier, especially uh, if you stick on the vintage mode and you push the red. I picked up from this Lepu list is the simulation uh, of the Soldano SLO 100. This is very very good. Uh, immediate crunchy and metal rhythm sound. <laughs> Last one from this Lepu plugins list is the simulation of the Bogner Ecstasy, uh, which to me really sounds versatile because it has uh, a very good clean tone. <laughs> you can crank it to have a, a more crunchy sound.
all the way up to a great lead, uh, mellow and singing type of tone. Now I have here my 7 string guitar and let's move on dialing some more modern kind of tones. In particular here I downloaded uh, always from the plugins for free site two uh, of the to me best sounding simulation of PV5150-6505. The first one is uh, Nick Crow uh, 7170 and it's quite inspired by PV5150. PV sounding uh, simulation I have here is called 8505, is always by Nick Rao, and to me it sounds very similar but it has a more uh, mid scooped tone. Moving on from the plugins for free series, we're gonna spend two positions, the 7 and the 8, uh, for the impulse responses. The impulse responses are very, very crucial in your overall sound. For the moment, the best impulse responses you can find totally for free on the internet are the ones from Zeta Impulses Factory. This is a pack which contains uh, foremost uh, Diesel, Mesa Boogie, Orange and Bogner uh, impulse responses. And at position number 8, we have here the free Marshall impulse responses from Red Wires. These are truly the best sounding Marshall cabin simulation and impulse responses you can find now on the internet. It has several different microphones uh, with several different positions taken from the cabinet. You can mix them, uh, find a balance between one and two left or right. They are very good sounding quality to me. Now let's finally move on to what to me represents the best free plugins you can find now on the internet. And these are uh, actually not just one plugin, so they are uh, some bundles released from STL Tones and ML uh, Sound Lab. STL Tones is a well respected and a very famous brand which makes awesome plugins and has released uh, since a couple of years this bundle called the Emissary Bundle which contains a very modern sounding uh, pretty much metal oriented head they called the, the Emissary uh, with his matching cabinet and his matching impulse responses loader which is called the Nadir <laughs> actually the best modern sounding metal uh, amplifier you can find for free. To me it kind of resembles uh, uh, an angle amplifier but uh, a mixture between angle and mesa boogie. It is very very versatile, it has plenty of tones, it is very very good. On the same series of the Ignite Emissary we have the Anvil which is another uh, plug-in simulation head in this case we have a much more vintage sounding amplifier. It is a free channel amplifier with clean rhythm and lead. It sounds great, it has a very pristine clean tone. <laughs> And you 
have your rhythm crunchy tone. And finally your lead. And the coolest thing about the Anvil bundle is that you have also a power amp section. The TPA allows you to enhance the tone of your uh, uh, preamp, which is the Anvil, adding less or more presence or depth volume, and also allows you to switch for different types of tubes, like the 6L6s, EL34 or KT88, with a different of bunch of options and tweaking possible. And finally, we have the ML Lab free plugin series, which is the Amp Roots, uh, which uh, has been sponsored when it came out by Ryan Brewster, and the uh, Amp Roots TVT series, which is uh, which has been made famous by the great and uh, funny TVT. <laughs> A great sounding one and it also comes uh, with a series of funny presets like the pancake, the banana, the grandpa gent <laughs> or the gendemption We are now living in an absolutely marvelous era for digital tools for guitar. You don't need to spend a fortune to sound good or to make your guitar sound good. You can easily find free plugins on the internet that either sound good and can serve your purposes, whether they are for practice or for recording. And also let me know in the commentary section below what you're thinking about these 10 and to me great sounding free plugins for guitar. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more content to come. See you next time!